A lot of people do tell me and ask me, why do I give out my recipes? Why do I give out my secrets? Hi, my name is Jenny Martinez, and I'm here with In The Know to talk about my easy homemade Mexican recipes on TikTok, and hopefully I can inspire you guys to get back in the kitchen. This was my daughter's idea. Today we are making tortillas de harina. She's like, mom, you have to post your videos on TikTok. A lot of people, they're, they're raving about Mexican food and, and you cook really good. She recorded me in 60 seconds. We managed to get it in there. The following morning, my phone was blowing up and we couldn't believe it that uh, one of my videos had gone viral. I get my expertise of cooking from my mom. She put us in the kitchen at a very early age. A lot of people will always ask her to cook for them in quinceañeras or weddings. She would wake up so early in the morning and start cooking, involving all her daughters. And she kept on telling us, one day you're gonna be making this recipe, so you make sure you learn it. I guess that was just a natural thing for me to pick up from her. Listo! And enjoy. A lot of people tell me that this is hard work. I said, no, the only difference is that I'm putting a phone or a camera in front of me because I'm already cooking this. For me, it's not, it's not that I'm giving away my secrets. To me, it's just sharing my knowledge to the younger community so we can continue our culture, the authentic Mexican recipes that our grandmas, our mothers passed down to us. Let's make carne asada nachos. Food brings people together. The whole Mexican cooking it's just something that connects us together as a community and as, as, as Mexicans. For me, in the kitchen, it's just involving all my family, my kids. But now that I see that in social media that everybody wants to learn and everybody wants to keep on the traditions, that's what I like, that's what I want to see. One of the tips that I can give to all my followers is just to start. You don't have to be an expert in cooking, just open the fridge, and start following my recipes. I try to make them as easy as possible. I'm gonna show you how to make Tosti Locos at home. You're gonna use your bag as your bowl, and if you see in the back, it shows you where to cut. A lot of people are not even familiar with some of the ingredients, but by me explaining it what it is also in English, it also it kind of opens the door for a lot of people that have never tried Mexican food. And a lot of people are always thanking me for sharing these recipes that they never knew they can cook. I honestly see the beauty in, in food and in the cooking. I mean, it's kind of like an art at the end of the day when you're plating it and when you see everything just combining, when you see all of those ingredients, that aroma coming out, to me, it's just beautiful. 